Hi, this is Gary with MacMost Now. Today let's take a look at the Services menu in Mac OS X. Now something you may have never noticed before is that if you go to the Applications menu and you look in there, there's something called Services. Now it's in every application and everything you do in Mac OS X and there's a whole bunch of different things in there. A lot of times they're grayed out. A lot of times they mention the names of other applications. The Services menu allows us to link applications together in different ways. Let's look at some examples. Okay, so for instance, here we are inside of Mail. Now we've typed in a message and we can go up here to the Mail menu, click on it and see Services. Now there's a bunch of things here but they're all grayed out. For instance, if we look at uh, Text Edit, you can see there's a couple grayed out options. Speech, a couple grayed out options. Well, the key is to try to select something inside the document, like select this text. Now if we go to the Services menu you'll see that some of these items are actually active. For instance, under Text Edit you can open a new window containing the selection. Let's do that and there we go. It opened Text Edit and it automatically pastes the selection we had in Mail inside of a new document. And you can do that with text in just about any document that supports the Services menu. Here's another example. You go to Services and we have that same text selected and we can go and go to Speech and say start speaking text. This is a test with an address in it. And there we go. So here's some other examples. Uh, we have that same text selected and we can go to services and then we can go and make a new sticky note. And we'll take that and paste that into a new sticky note for us. Uh, we can go ahead and go to services and go to font book and create a collection that uses all the fonts in the selected text. There's a lot of different things you can do. You can also do things in the Finder. For instance, you have a file selected. You can go to the Finder Services menu and you can do things like uh, open it using the Finder Services uh, or you can go ahead and use Mail and you see now there's an option to send that file. You can also use something called File Merge to go ahead and compare two files. Let's go ahead and do that. We've got these two files from our previous podcast. We will go Services and File Merge Compare Files and we will get this handy comparison between the two of them that tells you how they're different. Now what you get in the Services menu depends on what application you're running, what you have selected, and what other applications you have installed. For instance, I have the little local wiki editor VoodooPad installed and you'll notice that VoodooPad appeared every time I had a piece of text selected. That's because when I installed VoodooPad it added itself to the Services menu with some commands that it can perform. So as you add more applications you'll have more stuff you can do in the Services menu. So the Services menu isn't anything earth shattering. It's just a simple way to connect applications together in Mac OS X. But I've been getting lots of questions about it recently for some reason so I thought I'd do a show on it. I invite you to explore the Services menu and some of the applications that you use regularly. And remember to select things, either text or images or something else, before selecting the Services menu. Otherwise you may not see all the options available. Until next time, this is Gary Rosenzweig with MacMost Now.